Hello friends, today we are discussing the one more concept. What are the drawbacks of auto transformer? Previously, we are discussing what are the advantages of the auto transformer. Now we go for the what are the drawbacks of the uh, auto transformer. One by one, we are explaining. This is the auto transformer. 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 This is the supply side means source side. This is the load. This is the load side. This is the source side. This voltage is called V1 voltage. This terms is called N1. This current is called I1 current. This current is called I2 current. This term is called N2. This voltage is called V2. This voltage is called as V1 minus V2. This term is called N1 minus N2. This is the induction. This is the induction process. This is the conduction process. In output ka, an output side ka, 2 is coming. Conduction power is coming. Induction power also is coming. What are the drawbacks is there? One by one we are explaining. First drawback is the, the auto transformer. The auto transformer is not suitable perfect isolation of the two circuits. The auto transformer is not suitable for the perfect isolation of the two circuits. Means in two winding, in two winding transformer, these are the two windings. Perfect isolation is happening in two winding transformer. But in auto transformer, there is no perfect isolation between the two circuits. Second one is the, the auto transformer is not suitable less than or equal to 33%. The auto transformer is not suitable, the transformation ratio less than or equal to 33%. The, it is suitable only, the K value is greater than or equal to 33%, then only the auto transformer is suitable. Next fourth one, fourth one is any fault is happening on load side, any fault is happening on load side, the fault directly reflected into the source side, directly reflected into the source side. Fifth one, any opening on that, any opening on that common winding, any winding is open in that common winding. The high voltage, the high voltage directly passing through the load center means terminal voltage. The load will get damaged. The load will get damaged. Fifth one, the percentage of impedance is low in auto transformer. The short circuit current will be high in auto transformer. In auto transformer, the leakage current, the leakage flux is less. Leakage flux is less means uh, impedance it will be less. Leakage flux is less means impedance is, impedance is less. Impedance is less means percentage of impedance is less. Short circuit current will get the high. Short circuit current will get the high. These are the drawbacks of the auto transformer. Thank you for watching my videos. Please subscribe my YouTube channel.